Hi everyone, and welcome to this new course, Linux 5 Performance Monitoring and Tuning. The author for this course is Paul Alushile. Paul graduated with a diploma degree in computer science and is currently working as a cybersecurity expert. He loves teaching and hence he is freelancing to share his expertise with students for over four years now as a Kali Linux penetration tester. He has a diverse set of certifications, interests and experiences including server administration. Now let's take a look at the course overview. In our course, section one, CPU management. In this section, we'll focus on CPU running queue and the load average, perform glance monitoring with glances, check memory with swap management, view disk operations, and understanding network monitoring. Section two, handling performance issues in Linux 5. In this section, we'll be running analysis on the IO the input and output. Four subsystem that needs to be monitored, CPU, memory, IO, network, and working with strace for tracing the kernel and libraries. Section three, monitoring tools. In this section, we'll focus on tools monitoring for our Linux servers, install Nagios for monitoring our Linux activities, plugins, and also check the server performance with Munin and Nmon. Section four, power management. In this section, we'll be working with necessary power management strategies, improving our Linux server with TLP and CPU power saving states and managing the CPU slash proc slash CPU info file. Section five, the power of find. In this section, we'll focus on find command line utility that searches one or more Linux trees, files, users permissions and their groups also finding directories based on their date, time, and size. Section six, process management. In this section, we'll be dealing with the process management to control our processes with NICE, manage top highest and lowest memories in Linux, open files with ISOF, and confirming disk usage with DF and DU. The course prerequisites are OS, Ubuntu or other Linux distribution, storage, 40 to 50 gigabytes, four gigs of RAM. Here's the flow of the course. We'll be improving CPU management, work with monitoring tools for our Linux servers, controlling the Linux process management. Lastly, before we processed, let's check out our Linux machine information before we begin our course. We can get this information with the system screen fetch command on our Linux terminals. We get the type of OS, the uptime, RAM, and so much more. So. Let's get started.